My thoughts are that if fashion continues to stand still as a lot of retailers do now, it won't develop. It's essential that the fashion industry moves forward. I made a statement earlier during the presentation that if you stand in the middle of the road, you get knocked over. And the problem is a lot of retailers are standing still and they are middle of the road. They need to identify quite clearly who their customer is and focus on that customer rather than trying to be all things to all men. Okay, I, I personally think that there's room for both. I think there's room for the, um, the internet shopping and the fashion retailer. But what I find from personal preference is that often I've purchased things online and there is an element of disappointment once I've received them mm. because um, the quality is sometimes not as good or the colour might be different to what um, is photographed. So I'm probably more likely to buy my things from um, an high inter street. the high street. Mm. Something nobody knows. We had some good uh, suggestions. Um, I think the most important thing is that uh, we have to convince the clients that uh, they must not be scared. Yeah. Uh, we have to show them some new ideas. Uh, on the other hand, we have seen two things today. Uh, on one side, we want to develop something completely new. I agree completely to that. Uh, on the other side, I think we can use existing products and like I said, we have to do... Okay, we think the fashion industry will change with... Um, they need to uh, supply with more individual styles, more um, personality. Um, the stores will probably have lower budgets, so they need to uh, have uh, deliveries more often, uh, which makes the... Yeah, the risk for the stores will be to pick out what the customer really needs. Shopping should still be exciting. And I think that's the other thing retailers don't do. They're not creating the right environment for shopping. And I, that's a key point, actually, because it draws you in. You need to have an inspirational yeah. window. Yeah. And um, you walk past and you think, oh, I like that. And then you'll go in. Okay, you always have the risk that you will not succeed. Um, but when you do it on a small scale, I think the investment will not be too big. But uh, like I said earlier today, we have customers, they don't know where they have to go to. They are scared. Um, we have to show them that with really simple tools, when it comes to hangers and even when it comes to a store design, it's not a fortune you have to invest. The most important thing is know your customers and know where you want to go to, yeah? because that is something what has to be clear. And uh, I think Mawa is uh, ready for it too. The way we will face it is to offer yeah, more personalized, personalized products so they can show their style.